I really want to get today's self practice in. You might notice my energy is a little bit down and that's because I really want to be in bed right now. This is the part where we're just tired, right? December 16th, late in the month and in the day, night. It's very late. I'm going to see what's behind door number 16. A perfect Christmas pairing. It was a scene where he's choosing a coffee and I just thought the barista was such a fun role. What are we gonna do? We're gonna put a timer. But this scene is very, very short. So I'm gonna put a five minute timer and we're gonna get this thing ready in five minutes. And I wanna play it. This is a barista that doesn't take their job too seriously, but they just, they wanna give good customer service to give them like a little bit more of high stakes. I'm gonna say that they live in New York City. The barista lives in New York City and you never know who you're gonna meet, who's gonna, who's gonna be able to help you in your career. They're in that stage of life where they're just like so open to opportunity and they're ready for it. They're like, yes, let's get this next year. Like it's gonna be the best year of my life kind of thing, which I'm not there. Now I feel like would be a good time to just quickly talk about my goals for 2024. Wow, <laughs> I'm just like so delusional right now that I just want to talk about it for two seconds. I don't have any goals for 2024 because I'm so tired of having goals, making a vision board, and it just not coming true. The goals that I have been trying to set for myself and that I've been working for are just not happening. So how about in 2024 we have no goals we just work hard and let's see what happens that's it well now that i ate up a couple of minutes <laughs> let me actually start working on it is this chocolate coming right up okay <clears throat> this is the only thing i have to write on a bedazzled cup so this is gonna be my drink that i write on gonna have a name my time's up okay i'm gonna need a minute <laughs> I have some bad news. It's the middle of the night, so I don't have a reader. So now I need to go record the lines of the other characters so that I can react to some lines. What am I doing? Okay, I really need to, come on. Okay, I'm starting to feel a little bit more awake, more sane, and I'm realizing I don't even need a cup because it can just be off camera because I have multiple orders I'm taking, so. That's fine. So let's do a take. I'm going to do the take that I said I was. Okay. Can I get a name, please? Take two. That one's cute, but how can I make it better? Let's flirt a little bit with the person that's ordering, with Asher. Astrophobic coming right up. <laughs> Why did I wink? I never wink. <laughs> I think we're getting there. I like the flirty one better than the backstory that I had before. Let's do annoyed. For fun, let's just do I'm so annoyed. Name, please. Asher. Asher, absolutely. Also, by the way, if this is the first time watching what I'm doing, I this is an advent calendar full of scenes and monologues from Christmas movies and TV shows that are um, Christmas themed. And what I'm doing is setting a quick timer. Today I did five minutes, usually I do 15 minutes to prepare the scene. And then I do a few takes and I apologize for how like, sleepy i was early in the video but i'm feeling so much better now i do want this person to be annoyed but i need to be a little bit quicker paced because i don't want this scene to just be so slow that's something that i've noticed during self-taping this month is that i am trying to fill up the spaces too much and also making the spaces longer because i want to react to it so i just need to keep it faster because although i do want to be authentic in how i feel i also want to keep the pace going so my acting isn't boring. So let's do, I'm so over my job. I just want this person to go. They come in here all the time. Like, why don't they just know the menu and know what they want to order already? And the, why are they ordering so many drinks? They always come in by themselves. I get one. <laughs> I lost track of how many takes I did, but I am having fun. I think that's four, take three or four. Let's do it like that. I'm very annoyed. I just like the line is so long and my boss said, you have to finish this line before we can all go home. So you better hurry the fuck up because we close the door. It's just these customers and then you get to go home. Okay. Complicated drink. 
<sighs> you want to, uh, okay, this is the last one. I have to make this the last one. I don't know if I'm going to keep this in, but I'm going to play this as if I really need to fart, like a big, big fart. I'm holding in a huge fart because the coffee shop is small. The client's going to hear me. My coworkers making coffee behind me, even though they're making noises, they're going to hear me because it's a big one. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, I'm losing it. That's it. I'm going to show you maybe one or two takes. Let's see if any of them came out. Okay, I'll show them to you. I'll see you tomorrow, hopefully. Can I get a name, please? Asher. Asher, absolutely. Can I get one latte, mm -hmm. one peppermint hot cocoa, and what's your most, hey, is this complicated drink? Oh. You want something with multiple flavors going on. Something that when you take a sip, you're like, is this chocolate? Is this salted caramel? Wait, is this even a drink? What was I doing before I had this? Exactly. <laughs> okay, when Mrs. Claustrophobic coming right up. Name, please? Asher. Asher, absolutely. Can I get one latte, mm -hmm. one peppermint hot cocoa, and what's your most, how do you say this, complicated drink? Oh, um, you want to drink with multiple flavors going on, like when you take a sip, you're like, is this chocolate, is it salted caramel, um, wait, is this even a drink? Uh, what was I doing before I had this? kind of drink exactly okay one mrs claustrophobic coming right up thank you 